this like a unique screwdriver of some sort? I think something happened to the word wrap there. Wait, what? A guy who invents a new device, but he doesn't know how to get it out there. He invented the urinator, which is a device just for males, such as race car and long distance drivers or passengers. Wait, Even so it's, it's for race car drivers? And able to get to a rest stop. This is also- No, I've heard of medical tools that do something very similar. <laughs> what? Today I'm gonna to give you a pre- Where's- who's he talking to? <laughs> Someone he doesn't trust entirely. All right, countertop, I'm gonna tell you about this urinator device. <laughs> Race car drivers are guys that are wheelchair bound. This is the shadiest capital investor I've ever seen. Three pieces. The urinator. Discharge hose and uh, disposal bag. Gotcha. Okay. Disposal bag and the. But they have like these jugs for truck drivers, I know, so they don't have to like pull over and stuff. The beat in the background just screams urination technology. Oh, yeah! Of how quick and easy it is to make the connection when it's time to use that device. Okay, gotcha. Oh, you're not actually gonna use it, are you? What the f. What is that? A cod piece? I, I believe it works, you don't have to do a demo. <laughs> no, they're not gonna do a demo. I think he's just gonna like kind of, you know what I mean, like mock it, sort of. They're not gonna really it's do it. It's just like putting your wallet in your pocket. You're ready to go out. <laughs> yeah, for the no. Day. That, that's. <laughs> what we have here is a computer chair. And in a very odd place. To demonstrate what it would be like for wheelchair users. The same method can be used mm. oh, inside oh. of a vehicle. <laughs> no, that's just how easy it is to attach, you know. Now. Why is the okay? We get they're he's, just showing. He's us the totally bag. gonna fill the bag with his pee, isn't he? He's gonna do it. No. <laughs> no, they're just showing us how nice his shoes are. Wow, is this really I, necessary for the Kickstarter video? Are you not sold yet? We're we're doing this, huh? <laughs> Peeing on camera. Okay. They're a tube. <laughs> All right. Is ah, uh, he actually did it. Yeah, there it is, huh? Liquid gold, Texas P. <laughs> wow, that's uh. Yeah, just slosh the bag around. Why not? Wow, what a badass! <laughs> <laughs> Sold. So you know what I love about this device? Is that it looks so fucking cool you using. Need to use a restroom. And there's no restroom around. <laughs> there's no restroom around, like in my house. They try to get away from the car. With this but there's like a tree or... You're heading back to your car in your own privacy. All you have to do is carry a bag of your pee around. <laughs> or not, I guess you can just leave <laughs> it. This nice card It's gonna be in. <laughs> oh man. Now we'll show it does how it benefits race car no! drivers. Oh no, no, <laughs> come on, no. Don't do this again. We just saw it, we believe you. Is there another device out there similar to the urinator? <laughs> Yes, there is. <laughs> we did our research, and when the result came back, we had three or four. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Did it transition to the same <laughs> What makes yours better? Number one, it does not interrupt your driving. But I uh, can't! Wait, unlike yeah, what? Oh, like those jugs, I guess I was talking about. Like, you don't have to reach over and undo your pants, because you have this this thing that locks in. Head back to your car. For one example, I do construction work. The rest stop business is going to go extinct after this. <laughs> All right, now we're back to the other timeline with the other interview. What I have now is a provisional. What's a provisional? The camera's gonna pan down eventually, isn't it? <laughs> and he's gonna be surrounded by bags of pee. That's correct. <laughs> Stop! Why do they keep doing that? When my goal is, I need to get it out there. But they really... They need to have like a watery sort of fade effect. <laughs> to fit with the theme of the Kickstarter. Well, there's like, there's like four more minutes, so we've got time for that. Exposure and the help that you need to transform it from a provisional hmm. <laughs> Weird interviewer, you sound like you're reading from a script. I don't know. So what do you think about the urinator? I don't. Wow. What the There is going to be a lot of male long distance travelers. Wait, what? She's telling me. 
I could take Uncle Ireland, put him in the car, buckle him in, and take him to New York and do not have to. <laughs> Is look this for your her family? Stuff. No. Why do you? And then when we reach to the Labor Day parade, I could buckle him into his wheelchair and do not have to look for a restroom. Well, this device will be great for Uncle Errol. We could drive around the parkway all day long. Got it. Amazing. Under that road trip. They do. They cut her off. Yes. <laughs> Could you imagine taking your grandfather for a walk in the park in a wheelchair and not having to worry about finding any restrooms? This is, uh, you are telling me that this is with awfully that device, specific I use can cases use it on my too. patient without moving him from the wheelchair to the bathroom seven times a day. I, but what about the race hard? car scenario wow, we talked about? That is uh, how about the fact that there's other so things already that accomplish this? A dirty public bathroom. Or even risking a ticket or Stewie, like, you know, <laughs> please don't judge me. Yeah, don't judge the Kickstarter, Stewie. And make the connection. Yeah, that's great. Huh? You know how you're driving sometimes? And you really need to get the Yeah, I saw you put the thing on earlier, in fact. <laughs> yes! <laughs> you have way over explained this. Next thing you know, uh oh. Traffic. <laughs> it's one of the longer Kickstarters for a pretty simple concept. <laughs> You the guy who needed I feel like he made this prototype video with his phone, hence the lighting. I feel like he's hitting on me. <laughs> yeah, right? Wow. Too bad, my friend. I'm gonna try to use this as a pickup sort of technique. I'm driving along. Gotta go to the bathroom. So I stop and or I no, put this thing on. And quickly trying to find a cup. And cup? I can't find a cup fast enough. <laughs> well, probably because you didn't bring one with you. And guess what happened? What? You pee oh, yourself? You <laughs> Come on! Very great. There are so many other things I could have. You could have. Except for those who wear the pants on. Oh, that was heavy. Wow. <laughs> this device is really special. I work with patients every day that's in wheelchair, and it will help them a lot that I don't have to mm -hmm. run back and forth if I have them outside. That I took them to the mall. And it will be okay, easy. how many people are we going to interview about this? How many people can make it look like they're not so reading from a piece of paper? Do you think there's someone watching where the, this person comes up and they're like, okay, all the other people I didn't believe, but this woman, yes. This is really great. My mom. Person number 15, you have convinced me uniquely. And I think this will be awesome. This will be very instrumental in his running. But you know what I could go for, Beatus, is an unpaid testimonial telling me how good this product is. Do you think they'll have one? I mean, maybe at the end. I'm going to the park, not having to worry about going to the bathroom. Or about the creator looking at you in a very disturbing way, talking about how you must have this. All right. Well. I think there's a credit roll then. Yeah, good. Uh, so they need 5,000 bucks for the Philips Well, Uranator. they actually need $4,999. Despite interviewing what seemed to be a very supportive family, only one person has given $1. Uh, that's a shame, really. Um, race car drivers, long-distance drivers, or passengers and men, uh... Can be worn without being noticeable after getting dressed? Mm-hmm. Wow, this who thought this technology did not exist until now? Uh, only one pledge goal, 100 bucks, bumper sticker. Do you put that on your, uh... This is an expensive fucking bumper sticker. It looks like you can't even get the thing. Oh, yeah, um, right. Um... Doesn't even come with the device for a hundred bucks? No. It does actually seem like you did a little work, like it qualifies for utility patent and all that. But the problem is, too, that this money is only meant for the patents and beginning mm. the marketing process. So it's like, but how are you going to get funding afterwards? How is he going to get a patent for this? I guess, like, the unique connection thing, but, like, still, it's... I don't get, like, how you go from that to, like, all right, I'm just going to make, like, a million of these and sell them to race car drivers and wheelchair-bound mm, people. Absolutely. In my family. He also needs a trustworthy company to help market the product. Or the market the, pro Look at the this. project. Do you see the risks and challenges, though? Like, one of the biggest challenges that'll come with completing my project, finding a trustworthy company. Okay, fine. Sure. I don't want the product to get into the wrong hands. <laughs> who are the wrong hands? People who are going to be pooping into it instead of peeing. <laughs> Cobra Commander's like, I don't even have to get up from the chair anymore! Meanwhile, at the Legion of Doom... <laughs> this will stop, Superman! I can take over Gotham without finding a restroom! <laughs> Maybe the Joker puts it in his little flower squirt thing. <laughs> you have all that urine and nothing to do with it! Do you want to know how I got this piss on my face? <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
What is this? Is a cat for the... <laughs> Who's that? Solomon Grundy? <laughs> no, that's Batman. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why are you trying to use the bathroom? <laughs> like, you know. Uh, so, um, yeah, piss.